Hello, everyone, and welcome to the first annual exhibition match between Valen and Duday. Backyard Boogaloo. All right, you guys are good Someone to go. Tell me, starting out on Air Fusion here, which I believe was somebody's map pick. Who picked this map again? This is dude's pick, so dude's All right, this was hoping to just mag Valen forever. Five, so we'll see what happens. four, three, two, one. Fire at will. And we're off. Starting out with Valen right here. Dude spawning at the fucking AR2. Valen at back mag. Sorry, I had a lot to drink last night with Roman Rockets. Nice orb there from Dude is off its mark for its bounce. Valen gonna go to mag pillar. Dude gonna take control of top mag, which is where he's gonna spend most of the map. Dude having a slight advantage at long range fights. And there he is, camping AR2, taking control of his angles. Valen able to get around top mag. We should have a fight here. Valen, Maybe. dude we'll heard see. that, gonna camp a bit. Being very pragmatic, Valen able to get a drop on him from AR2, Ooh, but dude, dude able to get a bottom shot and a headshot. Taking the first frag of the match. There is no frag limit for this, but we are taking 10 minute best of five matches. This is the first map of five. Valen moving up. Dude able to get a drop on him this time, and then we get two shotgun kills. Early momentum for Dude in this match. Valen again gonna spawn a trench, not a whole lot of weapons back there. Duday able to take control of Mag Pillar. Doesn't take the Mag though. Because he didn't want to give away his noise. Now Valen moving the Mag Pillar might have be able to arm himself. Could come back to haunt Dude as he goes to back Mag. Dude at Mag Pillar, really wishing we had footsteps enabled in the server. I'm looking you at Mazat. Oh, he gets a drop on him there. Dude did not hear him when he's camping, and Valen able to get the first frag of the match. Cutting dude's lead. Dude is now going to spawn on top of Valen. Valen didn't hear it. It's a back mag. Dude, on the other hand, going to the zero point of the map, taking control of top mag. Valen hearing that coming from AR2. <laughs> Valen, and trying to place a pineapple nade, does not. He's going to back out and take control of Charger. Dude hearing that is not going to try to plan his assault. Valen, meanwhile, is going to fall back to Blue Room and set the trap at the control area. Do you have a ESP on, new guy? I might. Why is that? There's a little arrow on dude, so you can see where he's at. If you're watching, or whoever the opposite person is, that you're not specking. Well, I don't. I didn't download that. Therefore, I'm gonna do it the old school way by switching back and forth. Looks like dude's going back alley area. Oh, Valen's at front SMG nade. Dude, of course, coming through the tunnel now. This map playing a lot like Biohazard. The control being in one area and one teleport connecting the map. Dude is going is to gonna try to take RPG? the rocket area. <laughs> no, he was literally just said. He's trying pulling to set a Dallas. Track. I hope you're up. watching Dallas. No, no, Indeed. never mind. He's not. <laughs> Dallas, hopefully in Waco, Texas, right now to reenact some federal government overreach. <laughs> I JK, I JK. Well, I need to, meanwhile, at Mag Pillar, due to back Mag. Having a fight there, but exchanging SMG nades. Valen taking about 50 damage there. Dude, about the same, gets a nice mag. prediction mag. That was a good one. That looked like a rail, that looked like a rail shot out of Quake Live. That was. <laughs> Valen now really on his heels. He's going to fall back to back Pillar. Dude, meanwhile, going to go to back Mag, try to cut him off. Valen waiting for the SMG nade. Dude on the other hand, creeping up and able to get a headshot on a nice instinctive flick. The small scale movements are usually going to go to do. If Valen can try to uptick the speed of this match, it's going to play to his favor. If it slows down, it's going to go towards him. But right now, Valen playing, trailing behind two frags, cannot dictate the pace just yet. Yeah, I think this map's going to favor Dude with his playstyle quite a bit. Yep, it is a big open striking map. Still a lot of ways to connect, a lot of way to get around people's ears. Speaking as someone who is uh, the only person thus far in an official match to take a map away from dude, I gotta tell you, <laughs> the way you get him is by baiting him into the bullhorn attack, where you do a feint and then shoot him in his butt. Meanwhile, they both miss each other there. Valen gonna think about rushing from stairs. He will. Dude gonna go blue room. Valen really wanted to close the gap. He should know that he can get a headshot here. Doesn't take the shot, though. Dude, meanwhile, gonna pop out. He's rocket. Failing gonna ch camp ch top mag. Dude's gonna loop back around to the zero point of the map for the shotgun haul. Oh. Failing taking back SMG nade. 
boot camping the pillar hall. Not sure why. That's an interesting choke point. Everybody trying to listen for each other, but boot stamps out of premium. They only go into the front SMG and then dude should be able to see him here. He did. Failing to try being aggressive. Dude spamming nades, playing defensive out of position at the back pillar. Bailing, meanwhile, should take control of the charger. Dude's gonna get himself some orbs because everybody likes to piss off Biohazard. <laughs> Bailing, being really antsy with that. Dude thinking he rushed here. Gonna spam an orb for seven seconds. He should have heard those footsteps by Valen. Right now is at the AR2 area of the map. Dude is gonna spam that nade. Gets nice. Nope, Good damage. about 60 damage. Dude, meanwhile, taking control of the map. Valen hearing that. It's gonna try to go for a rush here. Doesn't get any damage on that SMG nade. Does get some there. Doesn't get fall back. Valen getting that downward angle. See that? that I, was I'm nice. not sure. What, I'm not sure what dude was thinking there. If he was baiting him into a crossbow, I could get that. But having somebody aim down at you with a shotgun is the poor Billy method to just fucking getting a kill. Yeah, he will definitely die. Both combatants being very careful right now, so we have a low scoring match in Air Fusion. I'm probably the only player that makes this map play fast. Dude taking control of the zero point of the map. Valen listening at Mad Pillar. Dude is now not sure where he is. He's going to get the drop here and does. Size the game. It's a nice bow nice. shotgun gun. Yes, indeed. They're talking about uh, RP money, not real money, Kenny. <laughs> I don't know if Kitty's listening or not. Dude able to get two mags there, taking away all of Valen's armor control. Valen gonna go to perch. Run out some G nade. Valen needs some armor badly. Yeah, he just took 150 damage from those very surprised mags there, close range. Dude should have seen him there at back mag. Valen gonna push the mag pillar. Dude's gonna spam the bottom hall. Not sure why he spammed the bottom hall and then didn't spam or check pillar hall, because there's only two options Valen could come from. Nice shot there at top mag. Dude, hearing that lift right there sounds at a premium. Now, dude should know that hearing that lift again means that Valen went down and out, but he doesn't realize that right now. Could be listening to the music on his nice headphones. I doubt it. I think he's he's really trying hard. I think he's really expecting both, the. I think he, I think he's expecting the high speed rush from Valen, and isn't getting it quite yet. He's a nice pineapple nice. nade there, and finishes him up with a lockdown spam. Oh lord, Pearson and Z-Man would be proud. <laughs> Dude spawning at back mag is gonna try to get right back into the control of the match. Spamming orbs fading now. Bailey right now deciding how he wants to defend. This dude goes back to trench. Dude's gonna give away his position and come out the front there. Coming out of tunnel now. Bailey has a shot there, doesn't hit it. Dude misses his. Damage is going there. Now Bailey out of position. Gonna be pushed to the back of the map while dude takes care of the perch. Bailey doing a bullhorn feint. How about he makes it right there? Puts the drop on the here. He does. Gets that first hit. He's gonna spam out. Dude has to fall back because he can't compete with a supercharger without landing a combo. Valen now going to get himself some armor control so he can do first and last damage in the next fight. Dude going to give away his position again. Valen going to try to get in position to pick him off with his mag. Does not get it. He gets high. But dude goes low. They exchange mags there. Valen going to get the high ground again. Dude's got to be careful. If you give away high ground and somebody's got a shotgun, that's a good way to die. He's going to try rushing at Valen now. He's trying to take the face. Now realizing the supercharger is empty. Valen, meanwhile, knows exactly when it's going to respawn. Out of position in this fight. Now going to try calling down the back mag. Still got plenty of time. A whole minute left. That's all I need. Just ask Kenny's mom. <laughs> oh, he is listening. <laughs> Ooh, Valen doesn't see dude right there coming out of Pillar Hall. That could have been a nightmare. Valen now going to take control of the lift area. He's going to consider going to the top mag area. He will give away his position. Valen, meanwhile, gathering the spam at back mag. That spam actually has been the difference maker. Getting close and knocking dude off his perch is like putting pressure on the quarterback. If you give dude all day, he's going to hit every single shot. 
it's in 30 seconds now, it's Valen is literally just dry humping every single SMG nade spawn. I don't know if I like this play, so I'd probably consider banning him. Uh, Valen gonna spam all of Running down the clock, too. Keep himself in this. He really is. He and really he has is. one frag, though, which is not a good cushion. It, it really isn't at all. Failing to spam orbs, doesn't know the dudes that live. Dude gave away his position there. Failing to keep spamming. Bait. Dude into a position he can't be oh, in and gets another orb, orb kill. Failing will take game one. Game over. And map one goes to Valenito. And a tactically spam filled match, and I want to ban him. I'm just kidding. <laughs> What's our next map, Viper Bird? I believe it's Dude's pick, so he can pick his second map now. Alrighty. So Unless dude, they're alternating. I believe, yes, yeah, since it, I think the format is whoever lost the first match, I guess, picks. I guess. So who just lost the match, picks is the next. I think it's up to you guys, really. This is an exhibition match. Really. Yeah, they can do whatever they around. want, really. <clears throat> Demo upload failed. What? Uh oh. I swear to fucking god. I swear to fucking god, Dallas. You the fuck out I of hope it doesn't right delete now. it too. I'll have to check. <laughs> you got to turn off the auto delete feature. Like we had it say demo. Let's see what did it yeah, say. Yeah, he did it for upload. um. He did it for SF2 because he doesn't have very much storage. But I have a lot of storage on the server, so it doesn't need to be auto deleted to fix that. Ah, yes, Uprising. A map notorious for making wireless mouse lose battery. <laughs> Alright, we'll keep watching Valen unless the stream wants to see Dude play, so it's up to you guys. Just let me know in the chat. Yeah, the menus are really nice. Alrighty, so air fusion final one to one short SF US so it looks like it's okay. I don't know. Dude, no. You didn't see the fucking console prefix? Oh shit, you're an asshole. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is why I fuck your mom, Kenny. That's great. Five, four, Kenny three. Such a troll. Welcome back to Uprising, made one, by a cute little nuts. Lock and load. And the only map that dude has ever lost, excuse me, lost in his competitive career. Sounds like a really sexy voice guy. Meanwhile, Valen gonna try taking control of the train card area. Dude gonna get the top, very crucial area with the fucking soap. Into the front back area gets a nice pineapple and shotgun mix up there. Actually, I think that has barely any damage. It's like now dude's gonna, gonna, gonna get a second kill here. here. Yeah, this this map plays a lot like Tick Creek. I actually think this map might favor dude, even though. Dude's had, I'm, <clears throat> dude's had a lot more experience. On yeah, this that's he what I'm what thinking. It, he knows what it's like to overextend himself. And then another shotgun kill right there. Not a lot of armor on this map. Just a lot of mindless momentum. So right now, dude running the table. It's a mag there and another shotgun. See, right now, dude knows that Valen can't do a whole lot of damage off the bat, and so there's no pressure, and therefore he's gonna take more shots. This map has no rocket, it has a supercharger, but barely any armor outside of that because it's a class zero map, made for 1v1 only. Only eight batteries on this thing. Excuse me, six, and then a small charger. Valen doesn't see, he, he was really late on seeing the Trying to go for the top side pick off. Dude, okay, he's gonna try to get But Valen getting a nice jump and a down, that must have been a 216 max damage shotgun. Holy yeah, that was, that was impressive. What an asshole. We still need to be. <laughs> Dude, you're gonna go to the front mag area. The high ping so uh, uh, try. He mixes it. Mix it. He gets a pick off of that mag there, but he missed that top. Of that. And then, dude, for some reason, rushing, doesn't spam a nade. Now cuts his lead in half. Valen missing that second shot. Valen can prove the angle. He's got to leave this mag. 13 HP and does not. Oh, that, that was a missed single bear right there. He probably does not help himself. He's falling right next to him. He's going to get some more momentum. He's able to defend well. Valen feeling some pressure, spamming that SMG name there. Dude, he's getting some orbs. Oh. 
Alright, gets a nice undershot. He now has the advantage there, but doesn't switch to shotgun soon. He's going full new guy, trying to get the six second mag on this map with limited HP. You don't necessarily need to do that. So different paces and maps still getting to Velenito. Dude going to the train cart area. Should have a fight right here. And a nice, nice whip around headshot. That's that's where Valen's gonna have the advantage on the sweeping shots. On shooting while moving. And again, cuts dude's lead to half, but this time the lead is now three frags. Superchargers back up. Wisely knowing that that's probably bait by Valen not taking it quite yet. Valen trying to isolate how dude could rush the supercharger. To go through that, both, both combatants with an orb now. Dude should know that that was an actual charge. So he it up with a shotgun. And then Ooh, that was a beautiful Valen one. brilliantly, brilliantly beats dude. Oh, and he gets a spawn. Oh, <laughs> wow. And now there's two frags on one orb. Biohazard is just rotating in his igloo right now. Going, oh, geez, dude. Okay, this game's a fucking ass clown. Oh, my God. And he's right. Uh, to anybody who doesn't watch HLTDM regularly, that's kind of bullshit. Valen uh, now is trying to pin down the back in that area. Gonna fade off. Faint and faint did more damage than he actually did. Dude, not biting. Kaylin now gonna How many try people we got in the server? We got, we got 18 people in here. Wow. All right. Meanwhile, dude, gonna give away a little charger position. Valen, that supercharger, isn't gonna rush that. Dude, trying to get some SMG nades for himself. Both players understand the change of tactics on this. Dude, gonna spam a nade. Try to give him. Bailing some false information. Gonna go on top of this roof and fuck the brush errors. And dude's already looking laggy at that. Bailing is kicking to the back position here. Oh, that downward shotgun got him good though. And dude able to catch up damage wise and take control of the charger. Taking like five damage from that. <laughs> That's a from Bailing there. Bailing spamming mag shots so he can get out. Dude, meanwhile, gonna take control of the office area. They only gonna spam. Dude didn't bite, though. Dude, right now, expecting an attack from the underside, doesn't realize Valen could get behind him. But he was right. Be feeling how Valen is taking wide angles for his shots, so he can build up speed going downward slope. Dude, meanwhile, gonna give himself some more. For that, but he shoots himself with the SMG nade. The corner of that brushwork really catches him there. Yeah, he's nervous. It's a mistake to do. Doesn't have any. Ooh, is able to get more shotgun there and then follows up. Oh my. He just out damaged dude on those shotgun exchange two to one. Dude probably saying, What the fuck is this RNG with the fucking shotgun? <laughs> Alien, meanwhile, gonna try to get an orb of himself. Dude, gonna again gonna go topside. Able to get the kickoff mag there. Valen doesn't see him. Valen spawns back. But Ooh, wow. dude, not realizing that's the thing. That if you don't get headshots, you're not gonna beat somebody on a charger with a mag. Charger gives you 80 HP per second. Game's all tied up now. 7 7. It, yeah, that it is. Valen now having much of the momentum with this tie. Dude again going on top of the rooftop perch. I come back to the train car. Valen so, heard that. So no, 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 Doesn't get the first mag, but is able to push him off and get the shotgun momentum. Valen settling in and not trying to pressure his mag is going to be the difference in this map. Because again, for those of you who play this game, it plays a lot of damage. A lot of shotgun momentum should get a kill here. Doesn't. Ooh, wow. And gives dude an opportunity to tie the game up with a headshot. Very new guy-esque of dude right there. Valen with a nice rage nade of his own, really making this map feel like Tick Rick. Making himself some AR <laughs> so chat's talking about a uh, an orb machine gun or orbs re resetting their timer upon a kill. What do you think about that? Um, I think I would like to avoid prolapsing my asshole whenever I play HL 2 dm so that <laughs> idea is absolutely terrible. Get that fuck out of here with that nonsense. I'm going to sick biohazard on you with this Korean <laughs> barbecue. We need that mod for, for SoCal. It would be fun. Anyways, <laughs> meanwhile, in a real game, in a real fucking game, <laughs> Valen is going to air hump the stairs. Dude doesn't see him. He did finally come back. That could have been a huge opportunity there for Valen. But the players, I don't know. Uh, dancing, thinking about an old machine gun. Dude misses that initial shot there, but then gets a follow-up headshot to tie the game. 
with two minutes and 45 seconds remaining. And spamming nades Ooh, and they wow, gave away his shot. position. Yep, yep, not a lot of armor for Valenito there. Meanwhile, dude at 160 has pretty solid control. Valen's got himself some spam. Ooh, go to charge. He emptied the charger, now knows it'll respawn at 127. He's gonna go for orbs, not taking any damage there from Balen's exchange. Gonna spam the way in that dude not realizing the charger is empty. Was almost out of position. Balen did not pursue through the middle though. You're gonna stay topside on the roof again, looking for the awkward first mag. Dude gonna back out of that when he heard the battery pick up. Gonna get himself. He's timing he's timing the limited batteries quite well. He's building himself a hundred suit stack without the supercharger on this exchange. Well, Valen at five AP. Gets the first mag, gets the second. Dude finishes up here and the prop. Oh Lucky gosh, you off. see the prop <laughs> sliding off the floor. But that prop Valen kills for like Ultimate cool. Warrior. <laughs> oh fuck that shit. It slid on the ground. He was just trying to get the prop out of the way. He had every advantage. He should have Ties had it back up. It dumped. Uh, wonky play. Dude, meanwhile, a back mag. Failing to take control of the charger. Probably the last charger stack of the map. And another match coming down to the wire. Exact opposite of my game. With we got the one 30, 20 something. And Valen gave him to get the underside advantage from charger. That'll give him a huge, huge momentum going into the final minute of this match. Valen says, I can camp awkward max spot angles too, bitch. Yeah, I think you guys played for, what, 15 minutes? But, I mean, it's still much lower scoring if yes. you were to yeah, it really is. These add 50% more tech. to it. They knew that the mistakes were going to be the difference. Ooh, beautiful response mag there. But Vidu does not have an SMG day, and he didn't pick it up. Lost him in there, gets a second mag. But Valen, finishing off with a headshot, should seal the deal for this match. Unless he's able to get a raid in there. He doesn't see the e the SMG. He is not using the prop. Getting what game he's playing at this point. Meanwhile, dude is gonna, excuse me, Valen is gonna take control of the charger. Dude is gonna try to spam the AR2, realizes he doesn't have the DPS for that, and then walks right into a shotgun. See, that's where dude is gonna have a disadvantage. If he tries playing at high speed, he's gonna get, see, now he's not able to match the speed of Valen, and the second map will let him go against him in this contest. For a quick momentum, as soon as Valen turned up the speed, he started fragging out. And a beautiful response by Valenito. <laughs> well played, well played. <laughs> well played. I want an enchilada, please. Which I have right here. And I cooked it on two bowl Sunday and it was massive. So I have <laughs> lots of leftovers. Probably not. Oh shit, I am. Am I breaking up for you, Viperbird? No, you're clear on my end. Fuck is with the server. Nipple titty. Well, I don't think we're gonna get to see lockdown at the rate it's going. This might be the last map. Testicles. Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah, Valen took Lock the last one. He got, got momentum right there at the end, like uh, Kenny says. He did. Get now, we're in the, now, dude will have to face three elimination matches, starting off with the defensive bow. Catches the nade, but took a max shot. It's easy to mop up the shot. And for those of you getting lagged in the server, it is not happening with Viper Bird Stream. Discord. So the Russians are obviously trying to DDoS me in this SF server back in because I sound too cool. <laughs> Meanwhile, Balanito hearing that little charge from dude there, able to get a surprise shotgun kill. It's an awkward, dirty, but still successful spawn kill on dude there. Dude is gonna spawn again. Like, gonna try getting a shotgun and rushing. Goes, that goes against that, of course. Gonna fall back to the mega health. Or mega charger, I should say. I'm not sure what Haymaker wants to call it. 
going to try to do it. He does not get the bad exchange there. Long shot or not. How is Valen still alive? Now, Court, he's, he, I know, he's just using the brushwood to his advantage, but mopped up with the shotgun there as dude finally gets on the board. Valen spawning a charger. Dude able to get an upper shot. Himself at 138 HP and do a nice shotgun play there to get himself back in the match. Anito spawning Mega. He's gonna think about rushing it. And will. Anito going to back mag now. Dude hearing him should have heard him there at the bow. Gonna try getting him inside mag. Doesn't get line of sight early enough. But then is able to get the first shot, the second shot. So much for Valence armor stack, and then shoots the explosive barrel. <laughs> we got a tie game again. Yes, we do. Dude then getting some momentum there, taking control of the lead with some take-crick momentum. Valenito did a good damage with that nade. Didn't see the pressure though, so he's not gonna do that. Dude gonna try camping at top mag. Valen should have health there. He's gonna shoot the wall rather than dude. Expecting to double back. Dude deflecting nades, electing not to return it, and just go back to aiming his mag. Yeah, I think Add those two hallway. nades in the little back hallway there are broken. You can't get them. Which nades? The two that are in that little back hallway where the crossbow is. Okay. Or like, uh, I think there's like a. What do you call it? An invisible or something? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it's a new map, so Haymaker fix it. Meanwhile, Valen able to get top side of the map. It's a nice double map kill there. He's got 50 HP. Gets another beautiful long range mag exchange. Feeling the match now. Get some take quick momentum there with a beautiful shot. Oh, my beautiful, I mean disgusting. I hate this game. <laughs> a double mag out of spawn, that's cool. Shotgun, eh, not so much. Meanwhile, dude rushing from top man. Someone's gonna hear him. This is the shotgun though. Could be in trouble here as he just lost a lot all the way back from that shotgun. He's got top side, but then dude doing an uppercut mag. Get himself back and control the map. Bailey gets on the front mag now. I call that front mag or back mag? I don't know. I haven't played this map enough. Doesn't matter, idiot. Yeah, it's a 1v1 map too, so call outs are gonna be not really known. Meanwhile, dude is taking full charge in the middle of the fight, bailing backing off. I think they both exchanged that hit there. Dude wisely rushing him early and able to get a nice shotgun kill. So there's top mag and bottom mag. That's what I've decided. That's what it is. I just weighed my hands. That is now what they are called. Meanwhile, dude able to get <laughs> a face melting shotgun. Looks like every single time there. So they say dude on Valen. Valen needs to be on the top side mag. Dude heard him get that battery. Time to shot perfectly. Now 8 to 6. And Ooh, favorite. That was Steven, unlucky spawn. 9 to 6. Getting stuck on the props. Yep. What a great feature, guys. <laughs> and lots of spawning momentum. It is now 10 to 6 in favor of dude. Dude taking his first of three match maps. Since Valen took two maps early on. Do I still sound weird? I do not. So the server has stopped DDoSing me. That is good. Yeah, you sound... I mean, I'm not listening to you in-game, just on Discord, but you sound fine for me. Yep, yep. Meanwhile, Valen, picking up no sound there. He's probably wondering how I sounded as well. Right into the shotgun. Now has to re control this map. Dude, doubling Valen's score now. Yes, indeed. That's good. We might uh, get a game four. Go the distance. Meanwhile, Valen gonna get himself refreshments at the G League's uh, soda machine. He's gonna come <laughs> downhill with that shotgun. Valen gonna fall back to Mega. Dude gonna try to cut him off. Does quite well. Valen blows himself up with that barrel. Not in good position there without a mag and an easy mop up kill for Dude. More than doubles Valen's score. Valen getting the topside SMG nade. Dude coming bottom mag. Valen gonna fall back to Mega. Dude hears him. Should have a nice long distance counter strikey stuff here. Valen opting to back off and build a stack before engaging dude. <laughs> no, the tiebreaker map that was loaded is uh, lockdown. Indeed. 
Dude getting the first of that mag exchange there. Balin with a larger stack, though, could consider pushing. Balin got a mag. Gets another defensive mag there. Gonna go shotgun and try to close the distance. Balin's gonna try getting armor stack. Gets mag again. I believe if, uh, Balin wins it, or sorry, if Dude wins this, we'll see Katsura next. Indeed. Meanwhile, Dude able to use the barrels to his advantage to take control of the Mega Health. Extending his fragment to eight. Should get another tinker. Kalen just looking to bring damage down. Try to make the next fight manageable. This map, I do believe Valen has played the least. No, he's played it a lot. Uh, we used to play it together a lot when it was in the contest. I, so, okay. Right. I mean, I'm not I much competition I... for Valen, but we play probably at least 10 or 15 games. Meanwhile, Dude continuing to exert his dominance over the supercharger area. Valenito trying to gather there. He would have heard him. The footsteps actually worked. I'm looking at you, Amazit. I gave you the source code to this. <laughs> Specifically, I gave it to Dallas, who got it to Valen is getting a defensive mag there and able to finally string some frags together. He's back to only having a score double, but it's still losing by eight frags. Sixteen to eight. Yeah, eight frags in two and a half minutes is. That's, that's, a, tall that's a tall order. With the spawn bullshit of this game, you never know. True, true. Dude, meanwhile, dude, meanwhile, gonna slow the game down as much as he can. <laughs> Expect him just to take forever to go anywhere. And then meanwhile, keeping his speed up, making a lot more noise. Hearing that, no exchange on that Over mag. Dude with the first hit there, going to go top side and then gets headshotted right there. After that kind of rush was his only move, dude anticipating it beautifully. Then, Jalen helps out, dude, suicide. as dude is now getting DDoSed. <laughs> I repeat, dude is now getting DDoSed. A guinea pig has now entered his internet. Yeah, it's lagging. Three, two, one. <laughs> I, 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 okay. I will. <laughs> While this lag break brought to you by Vagisil. When dryness lingers, get some cream on those fingers. Vagisil. And by Roman Drunk. <laughs> as long as you have cigarettes in your pocket, you'll be A-OK. -okay. Roman Drunk menthols. Suck that dart today. <laughs> Three, two, one, go! Valen electing to re- the Lag spikes are over. Valen electing to restart the match. Out of position there, but still gets a double mag to defend his lead, which is now extended. Yeah, his ping is. No, oh, it's Excuse going back 11. down, I think. <laughs> yeah, I was getting a mile of DDoS earlier. But he doesn't like that we're having fun on ourselves. And entering the final minute, with the score being 19 to 7. Apparently, Nito probably just playing for the next map now, but he does get a shotgun. Oh, nice. And another oh, one nice. there. Nope, he will not string that together. Basically, need to do to spawn next to him every single frag in order to get back in this match. Well, dude, slowing the game down, just doing damage to make it to the next fight isn't that difficult. Except that time he's rushing with a nade. That's often dude's like prerogative from pub play or whatever else. When he dies, he's gonna try doing one fade away nade to do damage, and that time. It was just And consistently going two frags to one throughout the entire map. Dude will take this match, and we will then go into playing Katsura again by the map of Haymaker. Should we need to go to a fifth and final map, that would be on lockdown. Which version of lockdown would we play? Game um, over. I don't know. Probably either the SF R2 or, um, yes, another one lockdown. I guess, it's, the, I guess it's their decision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Depends on if they want easy RPG or not, because, yes, another one has kind of a difficult RPG. Honestly, Viper, I'm gonna mute you in game as well, and then you type plus voice record in the map, and then everybody in the spectator hear you as well. Okay. I just now realized a lot of spectators aren't watching the stream are probably like, who's the new guy talking to? Oh, he's always been crazy. <laughs> there we go. It's working in here in the game as well. 
Can you people in this server hear? Okay, yes, they can. Excellent. Yeah. Okay. So you just got to type plus voice record on every map. So the next map would be Katsura. Would any of the players like a break to possibly urinate or consume liquid? Maybe lasagna. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. I'm going to take a break as well. Be right back, guys. My co-host is too delicate to say he's going to go so he's just taking a break. Welcome to Katsura. This map layout and all materials were made by Haymaker. This particular version was compiled with the Slamming Compiler tools by Salo Power. Ba Yukrani. Those of you unaware, Phelan took the first two maps. Hello by Dude taking the last map on Uprising. We're now playing Katsura, and if we need to go to a final tie-breaking map, be on some version of Lockdown that the players have yet to decide on. We believe it'll be the SF version. Or maybe one of the American versions. We need to make an R7 now that Fast Crawl is a thing again. Five. Uh four, they're stuck. Oh god three, damn it, you assholes! Two, Viperverse not one, back yet! Go! It's okay. I'm going to be back as well. Or be just getting a drink. All right, I'm back. All right, they started without you, and then I screamed, and then they paused the match, and by they, I mean both. Oh, okay. And no worries, it's fine. He's And I can type brilliantly, so everything's fine, you know. <laughs> they, I think they know that I can. That and then... Uh... Oh, Three, voice recording two, console. one, go! Alrighty, and we're off. I'm gonna be the first one to access the Buddha Mega Health. Alright, and we got Dude's POV this game because uh, I think Steph was requesting that. Yes. Alright, Steph, we're Steph watching Dude. Start streaming. I don't need to meet on the other side of the bridge. I'm gonna go through the teleport. Gonna spam an orb to keep the balance. Oh, was it a black screen? Did I push something? Here, one sec. Okay, you should be able to see it now. Excellent, excellent. Meanwhile, Valen at the RPG back mag area do camping the Buddha. The first spawn of the Buddha will be about 60 seconds into the map. These new power-ups that are grandfathered by a new guy have a default cooldown. Valen gonna camp at Buddha first due to be rushing in from the top side. No, he's camping a bit in between Charger and Buddha. Maybe he's gonna let Valen take him to the top side. Nope, he's gonna camp right there, wait for the spawn. Nice day, nice still at 150 HP. Dude on his heels now, gonna go to the top side of the charger area. Here's on the long range there. Doesn't deflect the barrel though. That took away his stack. Still no frags because the combatants are defeated quite well. Dude taking control of the charger. Bailing me while gonna fall back to the RPG. We'll be ready in about 30 seconds. And while camping the water wheel, here's those batteries there. Once an anticipation shot, Balin is not going to give it to him. 
now rethinking his life choices, is going to think about <laughs> going to the alley, then give away his position there. Pretty well done by Valen. Dude, going to camp the top side of Buddha. Valen going to again go to RPG. Might think about taking it. This is how class one maps like this map and Air Fusion player out. More Buddha control for Valen. He also heard the ringling bells of the RPG. Looks like he is going for it. Balin playing the role of the sergeant. I'm hearing that. A beautiful shotgun nade and then blows it up with, with a beautiful time shot of that barrel. <laughs> if you're gonna go, if you're gonna go for control items, you gotta clear those barrels, guys. And yes, that gives away your position. That's how the game works. That's why I don't like that barrel off the dude's left right now. I'm not sure what hazard that's justifying. Meanwhile, Valen should see dude right now. And then does and gets a nice. headshot from behind. Beautiful headshot. Tying the game up, bailing at the water wheel now. Do it. Shoot that SMG nade out of midair. What the hell is this World War II in a flat gun? God damn. <laughs> Bailing gonna rush the underside of the charger. D dude should see him there. Bailing gonna pop through the well, probably. No, he doubles back for a back shot. Does not play out That's well. Two. Yes, he does. Bailing on his Balance heels now. Hurting. Just gave away his position. He's gonna try looping around. He's gonna shoot his shotgun early. He Gets a little bit sweaty something. with that grip. Yeah, a lot of perspiration on dude right now. Yeah, Valen's really controlling the power-ups on this map, which is good to yep. see. Yes, it is. Well, dude, they try to get use a bump. Did not land any of his shots, and a ricochet, or should I say, fall back, fade away, magnum headshot gives Valen lead in this match. Dude, meanwhile, the teleport entrance is going to pop through. Valen hearing that is going to get himself some SMG nades. Loses his position though, he wanted to rush that top side. Dude's waiting for Meanwhile, now has the above ground. Try downhill shot and does not work. An uppercut shotgun. With Valen Valen should be not able to having get the boot. Anchor. It should be up soon. Yeah, but he is able to do these out of position shots because he knows he has control of the power ups. Dude, meanwhile, gonna pop through right in Valen's lap. Going to spam his SMG nades and mop up with a shotgun. The best way to beat dude in a mag fight is make it so his mag isn't that useful. Valen going the way of the cipher on this map, controlling every single key point. Dude, meanwhile, it gets out of position, doesn't hear any footsteps, and gives away his flank to Valen. And again, some spawning momentum there with the shotgun gives Valen a commanding 6 1 lead in this free map. RPG. Yep. Free RPG and a free now. RPG. <clears throat> RPG will next be up at 4.30. I believe Valen has been controlling the Buddha on the dot, so at five minutes we should see another respawn. I really hate how we're calling that a Buddha and that Mega Health, but whatever, I can't change anything. Well, Valen's spamming some rockets. I'm gonna trap dude. Nope, dude, it'll wiggle through. Dude might have his there. first Buddha. Oh, never mind, he's going away from it now. Yeah, he's, he's, the time. he's able to get a mag there. Could consider pushing up. Honestly, dude, with the way he was able to use his mag on this map in the earlier tournament, he might not have learned any of the item timings. The Buddha being at 60 seconds, the RPG being at 2 minutes. And then Vail wow, nice with an excellent, Holy an shit. excellent, that was an excellent protection shot from across the map. Dude now spamming a nade. Accidentally picking up a health pack. Failing meanwhile, doesn't need to pursue. Is not going to pressure dude with any of his anxiety or frantic nature going on now. Trying to get in control of this match somewhat. Failing being patient, going to build his stack. Make dude come to him. Spamming, spamming words for sound cover. Sees dude drop down. Beautiful prediction there. Gets the first mag of the fight. Good feeling that pressure all of a sudden has his aimbot get turned off. Eat your heart out, Subi Flow. <laughs> Dude, however, with a defensive mag there, but doesn't have the armor stack to be able to really pursue Valen and get him back. Try bullhorning him now. Charger is now empty. That should respawn in 60 seconds. 248, you'll see that. Meanwhile, the Buddha should be coming up soon. And dude, able to finally get a kill after that five frag run. And he gets and the then Buddha. gets Buddha control. Yep, that was the big thing. Valen got a bit grumpy there. Dude was just for that teleport and gets a mag kill. And then, with that stack, dude able to build some frag momentum of his own. Valen, despite getting two mags, loses that fight. 
Dude now with the rocket, he was able to time because he saw Valen was there. Trying to wake up and get some more powers, but wow, then Valen. That was a very <laughs> random orb. <laughs> that was, yes it was. Yes it was. That takes away dude's momentum, but he gets it right back with a downward angle shot of that shotgun. And we're able to spam that nade there, hearing dude walk down. Thank you, Area Portal, for allowing us to hear that set of footsteps. Meanwhile, dude at the Buddha area is going to think about rushing the back alley. Valen's going to peek a little bit. Dude camping by water wheel, to waiting to surprise yeah. Valen. Dude getting a bit impatient now, is feeling the pressure of the time. With his Buddha stack, though, he could be pushing through the mags here. Gets the first mag on Valen. Oh. I'm going to fall back in the back alley, dodging that SMG nade. It's another fadeaway mag. Off was nice. Okay, I'm feeling the pressure here, and then is able to do a beautiful anticipation SMG nade shotgun combo. Again, going very much the way of the cipher, controlling all of that spam, in addition to the majority of the power ups. Dude hoping to keep his control of the Buddha going, but here's at the charger. He's like getting a pickoff mag, misses the first shot, gets the second shot. Okay, I need to think about spamming orbs. Forces do to slow his roll, catch it. Okay, I'm gonna go for the Buddha control right now. Getting more SMG nade. Dude able to get it, it, it picking up on that pattern though, and was able to really surprise him. <laughs> Outflanking him and should get Buddha here. And he does. The final Buddha would be with 33 seconds left. For the four frag limit. Using the four frag lead, dude's gonna be feeling some pressure. Balin gonna be playing very defensively. Dude's got to get out of his comfort zone and get a lot of downward speed to ca like catch Valen. This is game four. And Valen is leading the one. This is the fourth, yes. So this is a match map. If dude wins this map, he'll have to win lockdown to win the match. Valen doing a hit and run thing. <laughs> Continuing to spam dude again the way of the cypher. That's slowing dude's ability to do any offense or fire any of those rockets. Well into the advantage of Valen here. Dude really trying to turn up the tempo. He's rushing the heck out of the back alleys. Valen, meanwhile, being very slippery in his defense. He's going to try doing a mag here. Misses it. Doesn't matter. He's going to go through the teleport. Make dude completely reset. Dude is able to get the high ground here. Valen's waiting. Dude gets his first shotgun. Take some damage from that right there. Dude with the stack. Able to weather it. And then Valen mops up with a magnum in beautiful fashion that should secure him this map and the map. Provided there's no miracle magic here. Dude having to be a oh. callback. Buddha. And... Mathematically speaking, dude has played well, took one map away from Valenito. This will go down as a 4-1 victory in favor of the Argentine antline. 3-1, but yeah. Map is, map is hard. Excuse me, you're right, you're right. A four <laughs> maps played, three to one. Apologies, I can do math fine. Fuck you. Beautiful match. Alrighty. That was fun. Let's do some post-game interviews. <laughs> All right. All right, new guy wants to do post-game interviews, so... All right, Kenny, you're the cameraman. My crowbar is my microphone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I don't have names enabled. Who am I looking at? Uh, dude. <laughs> All right, what am I you're going to Valen. I, I know I am. This is duty. Now, now you're looking at dude. Dude doesn't yeah, want yeah. to talk to me. Talk to Valen, Nito. Valen's like a shotgun. Hi. <laughs> Anyways. So. Valenito. Early on in these matches, dude was playing you really well at distance. He had to settle into a groove and it felt like surprising him. What were you thinking on Air Fusion when you were first losing your lead? So we need a Spanish interpreter here, or should I just be Valen? I was first thinking <laughs> this game is fucking gay, so I decided to start taking control of Charger and move in and out. Oh, that's interesting, Valen. Taught you that. Some gay guy called New Guy. That wasn't Valen. That was you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all righty, all righty. 
They'll do post-game interviews in Discord and whatnot. Meanwhile, thank you, Viperbird, for hosting this match. It was very fun to watch. Thanks for casting. Appreciate it. I don't it. think we're getting any more content here, unless dude wants to start using his microphone for the first time, which would be cool. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. Meanwhile, dude, dude, voice reveal with uh, 20, 20 players I'm going to fix SF. myself another drink. And then if we want to do more content, I will play a very vocal match against Valenito, since he has now earned the right to play me. Yes. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, Viperbird, are you still there? Yes, I'm still here. I got to run and yes. grab dinner, so I will catch all you guys later. Thanks. I heard Viperbird taking a breath. Thanks, and everybody, for playing. Goose -stepping, and his wife said, what are you doing? <laughs> got to go take care of the parakeets. All right, thanks, everybody, for stopping by. I appreciate Valen and Dude for giving us some good games. Um, the uh, replays will be uploaded to HL2DM TV probably within a few days. Um, so look out for those if you want to rewatch them, and I'll make the video public on my Twitch so you can watch that as well. Yes, that was very fun. For some reason, Viberbird isn't doing his closing stuff, but thank you all so much for watching. Especially in this broken game. Trying to keep it alive. Excellent frags by both of you. Excellent strategy by both of you. I loved when Valen was able to capitalize on some momentum at the same time. Dude, you did a great job trying to slow the game down when you could. And I look forward to many more matches like this. Thank you all much. And from Viberbird's stream with the... 911 tag, maybe? I don't know. I don't look at it. He just left Discord. We're all A-OK. -okay. <laughs> Alright. Later, guys.